Alright, hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to South Park, The Fractured But Whole. The, uh, I guess sequel? I don't even, I don't even know how much carries over from Stick of Truth to this. Uh, but I picked that up on a whim, regretted it immensely, uh, said some things, saw some things, uh, that I really wish I hadn't. And now here we are, and let's play this game. New game. What has become of this city? There used to be laws. Justice. Not anymore. Crime is out of control. Cats are missing, and townspeople are being victimized. Oh, hey! Who pooped on my porch? What's going on with you? Whoa! Whoa! We were supposed to protect those who couldn't protect themselves. G get off my car, you little pecker! Now superheroes are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. But war isn't going to save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, ma'am. There's no time to waste. I have to go back, change the present if I can, and find this cat. And in doing so, Perhaps I can change what has happened to all of us. All right. So, uh, if you haven't seen my Stick of Truth playthrough, you should probably see that beforehand, just because... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do that. Uh, just because there are going to be some details that carry over, and also it was magic. So, the last time we played this, we played as uh, my good buddy, my good buddy Birdcatcher. This actually looks maybe a bit closer to his real hairdo. Maybe. Yeah, no, the, the weird swept over hairdo that I had originally given him, I guess got turned into some kind of bizarro mullet. Yeah, this. This is the hairdo I gave, but I don't think Bird's got uh, long hair like that. Well, we've got a couple options. We could be truly terrible and play a shell, but I don't think we want to do that for any, any reason. I don't think she'd forgive me. I don't think she hurt me. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, and then for whatever reason, I gave him... I gave him like forest green hair. I don't really, I don't really like this hairdo though. Oh wait, hold on. I forgot. Bird is broccoli. <laughs> do we do this? We might do this. Maybe we should play a shell. No, no, she would not like that. So instead, we're gonna keep playing as as uh, Captain Broccoli. Uh, A.K.A. Birdcatcher. Oh, we get to make him a superhero too, which is magic. Okay. I don't know if he has freckles. It's been a while since I've seen Bird. In fact, I've only ever seen Birdcatcher in person once in my life. So my actual recollections on what he looks like, um, I don't have any. To do freckles, to do these. Let's see if I can change his skin color, facial hair. Oh, hey. Obviously. Okay, there we go. Now, if you don't know me, and if you don't know uh, my friend Bird, I like to make fun of him constantly uh, because it makes me happy. And I assume it makes him happy, but I have yet to uh, I have yet to actually ascertain if he's really comfortable with the uh, the goofy shit that I say and do to him. But that's fine because he can deal with it. So we were making Captain Broccoli, and then some. Can I not change my pants color? I'm... Yeah! No, it doesn't look like I can change my pants... ...at all. Huh. Well, that's... That's okay. Yeah, skin color is the difficulty slider. That's unfortunate. I was hoping I could make him green. 
So choose difficulty. <laughs> well, I, uh... So, I know, uh... I know how Don't difficulty works this. Don't worry, this doesn't affect combat. Just every other aspect of your whole life. Yeah, so it, it reacts, uh, it affects how much EXP and money we gain. Now, this is actually kind of a difficult thing for me, because Bird is, like, literally the whitest guy I know. Uh, and so while I could do hard mode, I feel like it would be disingenuous. Uh, I, I feel like I should probably put him in the middle of the spectrum from a gameplay perspective, or actually be true to the bird catcher and make him comically, uh, comically pale. I don't, I don't know. Oh, you can increase the difficulty in game two. Well then, perfect, thank you. Refitty in cash. I... Huh. <laughs> All right. This is already off to a good start. I love the fact that my hairdo is actually affected by the crowd. We should be happy that he's made friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Didn't see you there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, look! You brought a towel! Hey, man, I'm Towel, your gaming bud. I'm gonna give you some tips from time to time because, well, who doesn't like tips, right? All right, then. I'll see you later. Suddenly, I regret uh, getting the season pass for this game. Actually, let's go back and watch dad some more. I mean, how many of these things is he gonna eat? Or no, this one's infinite. So he's probably eating edibles. That's the point of it all. Yeah, so I can't do anything more. What the? Oh, this is my room. Oh, my game sphere is updating. We'll probably remain doing that for a while. I... Okay, so we got an alien probe. Wreath of Elf Ears, Grand Wizard King's Robes, King's Robes, Princess Kenny's Gown. Whole bunch of goodies. It'd be cool if this actually let me carry everything with uh, from game to game, but that would that would leave me a ridiculous, overpowered wrecking ball. That we probably don't want to do. Yeah, it really does look like they've improved this game in every way. Oh, I can... I can already fart. Oh, combat difficulty. What's the... Okay, so it's... Combat challenge is currently on heroic. Oh, I see. So, I really did put it on the easiest, so I'm going to be getting the most reward. And whatever, I don't really care that much. Inventory. Uh, oof. This is some stuff. I don't know if I like the, the new user interface as much. So, these are components. Mission items. How do I change my equipment? Uh, like what I have equipped though. So I can smack. I can do these. You can fart a lot. 
I guess we'll probably get a tutorial to change my equipment later. That's unfortunate. I, I was really hoping I'd be able to, uh... Mommy, stop crying, sweetheart. I just have something stuck in my eye. <laughs> well, this went to shit fast. Apparently, this is like literally the day after uh, the previous game. My lord, the filthy Morish are attempting to overtake Koopa Keep. You gotta come fight, my liege. You're our only hope. My lord, come on, dude. What, you just moved to town and you get to be king? Well, I think you're a little pussy. Go, king, go! Oh. Teach him a lesson, my lord! This is new. Press X to select your power. Okay. I... Huh. Powers with knockback can cause extra damage to enemies by knocking them into other enemies, allies, or objects. Oh, boy. This is new. Oh man. Okay, really hit him this time, King. Okay. So this they changed the combat fairly drastically, actually. Ow! We can't stop him. Ready the guards of the dark court. Wow, did you see that? The king's amazing. His powers are unparalleled. You can't take us all on. Yeah, just walk away. Now, do I have any new powers? Attacking an enemy first grants combat advantage, giving you the first turn. Ah. To see the full combat turn order, check the timeline in the lower right. Different powers can affect different areas of the combat grid. You can preview a power's range by checking the diagram yeah, under its I, icon. I'm supposed to go first. Nah, -uh, the king got combat advantage. He goes first. Okay. Well. Wah! You show him, king. So it doesn't look oh, like... humanity. It's fine, they're the bad guys. Oh yeah, go king! It doesn't look like we have you the same, like, the down. blocking and active combat. Well, I probably should have waited on some of these things. Oh, well, that's okay, yeah, we do. Uh, let's see, I could go up. Which of these guys are the most injured? I guess this guy is. The yeah, we don't, I, I don't think we have active uh, attacking or blocking, which is actually really cool. King is undefeatable. That's gonna make this a lot easier. Probably should have actually just hit them regularly. Ah, eh, whatever. It doesn't. It doesn't matter. This is tutorial time. The grid is fairly small. These battles are fairly short, though, so it kind of. It's fine. But I'm so glad they took out the active combat. In favor of kind of the tactical grid. That's a cool that's a cool feature, and I can't wait to figure out how I can exploit that instead. I wish the corpses would actually properly pile up instead of just kind of stack there. Let's go! We've got to get inside Cartman's house. Stand aside or die! We're going through that door! You can't. Oh yeah, why not? Because everything in front of here is lava. Oh, dude, no way! All that is lava? Yep, everything from here to here is lava. You can't cross it. Shit! Come on, let's get inside. We can't. They're seeing everything in front of the door is lava. Ah, oh, that's not fair. What do we do, my king? What do you do now? You die. Release the dragon. A dragon? We're fucked. That's the dragon roaring. Enemies may attempt to attack you while you explore. If an enemy in ambushes you, they'll automatically it's get the first pissed. combat turn. Okay, well if I knock back if I knock this guy back into the dragon <laughs> bonus damage. Yeah. Oh he's Oh no, new guy's <laughs> still alive. That guy's running away. I gotcha. Now does my HP Ready the fire breath. Strike red squares indicate a damage zone of an impending attack. Move to a safe square to avoid Get getting hit. Don't end your turn where it's gonna hit you. Okay, to end your turn, hold right bumper. 
Yeah, so it looks like I still heal between fights. Now, does that hurt allies? Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, if you get a fire breath attack, our king gets his hammer of heavenly rain. You can't stop the kit. Car. Car. Stay out of the street, damn kids. Clear. <laughs> oh, that was kid. good. You can't stop the king. He is all powerful. I got a bad feeling about this. What a tiny. Whoa, shit. Dragon Slayer. King douchebag. Hell yeah. Oh my god, he defeated the dragon! No freaking way! That kid's amazing! Oh, and that clears the lava. hey -o. But it is locked. Never mind then. Maybe there's a way in through the garage, my lord. If there's a way in through the garage, the king will find it. Yes, only the king can find the secret way in through the garage. If, I mean, if there is one. Yes! Only the king with his infinite wisdom and strength can get past this impassable barrier. Oh, I see. I have to take the whole step ladder ahead, around. We Use probably want to bring it over here, don't we? Oh, there we go. Bag of search a skillful warrior. Did you see how he moved that ladder and used it to climb up? He truly this is, is so facetious. All Holy fuck, he's amazing. I thought the king was going to do a sweet jump, but then he just did that. You're dead. <laughs> really? Okay, that's a new one. Speak, Bard! What happened to the Stick of Truth? The wizard had it thrown into the ocean. Lies! You shall feel the wrath of the Moorish! Unhand him, you heathens! Release the Bard or you'll have the king to deal with! The king? They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right! And if you don't... Uh, wait, wait, whoa, where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. <laughs> the wizard is gone. My name is the king. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point. In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That that sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the $100 reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Hoopsikins! There's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom. The Coon Alert! Come on, Coon friends. Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair. In the future, Coon and friends assemble. Sorry, guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now, and you guys are dorks. Nobody asked me if I wanted to play superheroes. We could all go to my house and sit around, staring dejectedly at our hands. I've been thinking about joining a gang. This might be just the kick in the pants I need. Well, that was fast. Well, <laughs> look at how they just abandoned the king. Oh, they, yeah, there's no sprint button. This is the maximum speed. Oh, right, the Rock of Insanity. I forgot about that. Oh, hello. The boys are down in their little basement playroom. It seems like anything with a gold handle could be open. Give it a shot. Well, first off, we loot the uh, we loot the place. You, didn't I just rob this effectively chronologically three days ago? Maybe four. Let's see if the toilet's still running, or not the toilet, the shower. Well, I guess first, let's grab all the other stuff. <laughs> Stallion butt hut, butt plug. Jesus. Uh. Howdy ho, gaming bud. When you enter a bathroom, don't be shy about taking a potty break. You can get some neat stuff when you use the toilet. Good luck, bud. So the reason why I can't change equipment is because it's all superhero stuff that we don't get until later. 
Who is the coon? Da Danishes for Denmark? All of these are references to things that I uh, do not know. So... Oh. Press X to crack... Punch cracked objects. What's cracked? Oh, the lamp. Okay, Cartman's Journal. Christmas list ideas, 2017. Drone, GS4, hoverboard. Shitlist, Kyle, Mom, Clyde, David. SPC principal. It's important. Can I turn off Towley? Let's see if I can turn off Towley. I don't don't know if I can. God damn. I'm I have regret. Let's see. Is he a mission item? Towel. I have I don't think I can turn him off. Well that's okay. I <laughs> yes, Ooh, boy. Somebody appears to have put lava in front of my door. Well, no, it's not hot, but my son told me I will burn to death if I try and cross it. Fuck. Uh -huh. You. Oh, yes, he did tell me that if Mom. I step on a crack, it would break my mother's back. Maybe we should go to Raisins and see if the waitresses know anything. That's not enough, Mosquito. We have to act fast before the Freedom Pals can. A hundred dollar reward. Do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise? That cat looks pretty old. Maybe it just died in the gutter somewhere. Human Kite, do I have to remind you that as of right now, Freedom Pals have a hundred followers on Instagram? We have six. The five of us and Billy Turner, who's a ginger. This is the key to finally beating those fuckers. But where do we start looking? That cat could be anywhere. We need to split up. Mosquito, take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito away. Human Kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Super Craig. Fast pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on fast pass to get there fast. Excuse me. Oh, right. I forgot. Butters is Professor Chaos. Franchise plan, the Coon movie, Super Craig, Man of Craig, the Human Kite movie, Coon and Super Craig, Coon vs. Super Craig, Fast Pass, Fox series, Coon and Friends 1, the animated series, Human Kite movie, uh, let's see, Phase 2, Coon and Friends 2, Armageddon, Rise of Captain Diabetes, Fast Pass vs. Mosquito, direct to video, Young Coon meets Young Professor Chaos, begin prequels, Mosquito, Tomorrow is Yesterday, Little Super Craig, Cartoon Network, Fast pass. Forward to the past. Super Craig X, not Wonder Tweak. Japanese. Uh, let's see. These are dumb. Final Coon and Friends movie. Intro a chick. Oh, right. There might actually be, like, a female character in this one. Well, not that it really matters. Hey, 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 hey! Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy! Jesus, fuck! Mom! The new kid is trying to play with the cube of ultimate destruction! You be nice to all your friends, Eric. Be a good sharer. Good sharer? It'll blow up the fucking galaxies! Stupid bitch! Look, dude, we already told you, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. Uh, all right, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself useful. Go grab me the Stephanasy device. It's over there. I think I skipped Never seen something. the coon cycle up close, huh? Well, I've never seen someone so bad at finding a Stephanasy device. Those costumes are tailored to the Coon's unique body specs. You have to be pretty buff to fit them. You seriously can't find the Stephanasy device? Us superheroes use inspection mode, you know. That's our holding cell for supervillains. Why would we keep a Stephanasy device in there? That. 
That's the... Okay. Well, that took long enough. Is the furnace device active? <laughs> you really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ABLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? All right, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Koonstagram. Do you have a Koonstagram page? Oh boy, you're not even on Koonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. Fucking unbelievable, let's see. So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? Since you're a newbie, you can only choose between three for now. Brutalist. Close range brawler, fist related injuries, hitting things into near orbit. Speedster. A uh, hero capable of bending space time in order to mete out justice. Blast. Blaster, don't just watch the world burn. Let it on fire yourself as a blaster. These damage dealers are deadly at any range. Uh, so yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. What do you guys think? I'm brutalist. usually a brutalist kind of guy. Blaster. I just don't know. I mean, do we want? What do we? What do we think the broccoli is? Because I usually go for brutalist. tanky type. A dudes. sense of urgency is also an important trait for superheroes. I'm seeing almost nothing but. Uh, Oh, you get to be all after a bit. Okay. Blast. I... Hmm. I like the Brock Fist, though. This is kind of a big moment in your superhero life. I don't know. I guess I was just expecting a little more enthusiasm. What if I could... What if I can call Bird? This seems wildly unnecessary. Anyway, we're actually going to go Brutalist due to my usual, well, <laughs> my usual proclivity towards fist-based iconography. A Brutalist, like the Thing, or a really pissed off Batman. Okay, and sadly it doesn't look like we can really read any of these, but whatever. We're going to go with punching. It's fisting time. Okay, douchebag, but now we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. You lay awake that night. Like so many other nights, you couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. You walked to the mirror. Well, first, can I loot anything? You walked to the mirror. Nope, screw you. Over there, the mirror. Just, okay, just walk up. No, not there. Not, God damn it. <sighs> oh my God. Is that it? Is that the last thing he's gonna say? Aww. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. Oh, God damn it. You left your room. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them. So for the first time, you called upon your super strength powers. A super strong brutalist hero, you cracked your knuckles and prepared to brawl. You met the intruder's mocking words with a swift, brutal bash. Knocked backwards, the intruder's head spun. Damn, what are you, some kind of superhero? Weakly, he retaliated. You had him on there the are ropes, quick time but events. Then two more ne'er do wells entered the fray from behind. So you turned around to face your new foes. Okay, so. We are going to have to... Charge yourself into them. Oh, I see. From here? Yeah, from here. 
Your wrecking ball like inertia sent one trader tumbling into the other. Uh. I'll take care of the kid, fellow ne'er do wells. The first intruder ran into the fray, boxing you in, right where they wanted you. We've got you right where we want you, kid. <laughs> what are you gonna do now, superhero? But it was you who had them, as you executed a powerful blast from your bowels. It does look like the QTEs are better, though. Like a lot easier to work with. Oh, I can't take it anymore. <laughs> One of the thugs was so grossed out that it literally finished him off. Nice. As his companions fled, the biggest, ugliest intruder moved in closer. He threw his fist into your body, but with each hit, he only unlocked what lied beneath. Something totally brutal. <laughs> yeah, fucking sweet, man. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. I've been there, done that. Wow. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? All right, now that you're a superhero, I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Coonstagram. It's the only way our franchise will survive. Well, first and foremost, we got some shit to do. Uh, let's see, costumes. This is the important part. Okay, yeah, this is what we're looking for. All right, so we got the crown. Digging that. No, are these purely visual? Uh, they might be. Actually. Doesn't seem like we've got stats anymore. Though, there are slots that we can get. Huh. Yeah, so it's purely cosmetic now. That's different. I was expecting... something more. Well, that's interesting. So, ah, character sheet. This is probably where, uh, where the important stuff happens. Your character sheet tracks your progress throughout your superhero adventure. Earn titles to fill your character sheet. You'll get XP and the coon will leave a reward in your bedroom toy box. Okay, so we get different artifacts, puzzles, power source, anal. So titles, ability, summons, farts, race, and ethnici uh, ethnicity. Bleh. I can't English right now. And inventory is just full of garbage. Yeah, pure garbage. Don't care. All right. So I guess I'm just supposed to go out and, well, do shit. Hello, child. I'm Jesus. I hear you're the rightful owner of the relics of Zaron. Check your bedroom box. Okay. And hold... Oh, find people to take selfies with. You can take selfies with people that have a camera icon above their heads. To request a selfie, approach someone and press right bumper. Oh, a selfie. Yes, I've heard of those. New follower, Mrs. Farnacle. Oh, wonderful. I'll see you on the internet. <laughs> okay. Got questions. Okay, open up Instagram, see the selfie we posted. Miss Farnacle is now a follower. Only people who pose in your selfies will follow you. Press Y to see who you are following. When someone follows you on Instagram, you automatically follow them back. Gain more followers to increase your hero rank in your character sheet. 